You know, Kathleen, I saw you speak and you, you said a phrase that said, live by decision, not by default. Yeah. Uh, can you share a little bit about what, what that is? Yeah. I, so I, you know, when people get the, the book or, you know, or it's, it's, in, you know, it, I signed that book with every, with that quote, every book and um, it, live life by decision, not by default. And what that means is, you know, and this, I think this, let's face it, this, you know, this time period in our life has forced us to be more aware and to be more intentional. The, the fact is we have, many people have lost people during this time, you know, they've experienced life in a different way during this time. They've been disrupted you know, during this time, you know, holidays have been have changed. You haven't been able to see family members during this time. You know, things have been changed. Um, and sometimes you get another day back and sometimes you, you don't get the same day back as you, as, you, as you did. What this time has taught us is to be intentional, um, to, to not let life happen to you, but to make, to make life happen for you. It's a very different energy. Um, don't, let, don't watch life happen to you, make life happen for you. Live life by decision not by default. And that way, when you decide to do something, uh, like, hey, I'm gonna work out today, because guess what, you know, I'm going to work out today, you have 24 hours. And hour number 23 is just as important as hour number five. But it's up to you to decide that you're gonna do that, um, you know, as opposed to letting the day happen and, oh, and you didn't do that. So, so, that, so, so live life by decision in your career and in your life, uh, Cody, it is about being intentional. It's about saying, this is what I want to do and accomplish. This is the effort that I'm going to put in to make it happen. This is the result I'm going to create, and I'm going to commit to making it happen. Uh, no, that's awesome. Uh, well, I know we're coming on time, uh, Kaplan. Uh, this has been amazing. Uh, it's been a treat for me, and it's certainly I know it's everyone's going to get some um, benefit out of this. Uh, I see a number of decision makers uh, on here who are influencers in their companies who can take some of this information. We're gonna have the replay available uh, for people to share. And uh, Kaplan, I, you know, I, I hate to do it to you, but I, I'd love to, you know, have you uh, one give us some final thoughts. But more importantly, we'd love to have you go out with uh, like we came in with a, with a little bit of performance. <laughs> little, little, uh, little. So I see it. Away, I, see right? it. <laughs> I see it. I see it. Thanks, Jesse. I see you in the comments. Um, so a couple of things. Yeah. So we'll, yeah, we'll get that all queued up right now. Let's do that right now. I love that. So, a couple of things. Um, so, so one, I you know, I think that we have to embrace this time, right? You know, this is a, it's, a, it's a tremendous time of of, of a time to shape your brand. Um, it's a tremendous time of, of empathy. You know, people have empathy. You know, we know that you know the things have happened and we've been disrupted, um, but you have to have new courage, new courage during this time, you know, new courage for your career new courage for your brand, new courage for how you lead your team, new courage for the innovations that you want to advance in your organization. This time has given us you know, the grace to have new courage and that new courage to be intentional about what you wanna be known for is what drives an uh, amazing, powerful result. So, you know, so, so be, you know, decide what you wanna be known for and then be consistent to, to make that happen. And, and when you do that, uh, amazing things happen. And so, I'm gonna I'm gonna put this music on, Cody, and um, I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure that, that we get closed out the the right way. There you uh, go. I, thank you so much. So we, we got Amy. I want to thank you, Ashlyn. I want to thank you, Brooke Avila. I want to thank you, Sierra Parts. I want to thank you, Dawn Fingers. I want to thank you, Jake. I want to thank you, Kim Ellis, courageous Kim Ellis. I want to thank you, Kunz. I want to thank you, Jeff, and all those that are on. So we're gonna close out like this: one, two, three, four, one, two.
I had to go. Right, all right, all right, all right. Hey, that's fan, that, that's fantastic, Kaplan. Uh, hats <laughs> off to you, man. Amazing, amazing information. I I'm, I'm feel really blessed to have you here. You're an amazing speaker and a good friend, and I, I really thank you for coming and do this so much. Any parting uh, words? Uh, listen, I just want to say thank you for all that attended. Please connect with me on LinkedIn. I would love to continue to be a resource to you and your organizations in any way. And, uh, you know, go out and live the power of your personal brand. It will make a difference in your career and give you purpose and clarity in your life. So thank you so much for having me. Uh, thank you all. Jesse, I see you. Thank you so much. And uh, it, it's been a pleasure to be with you today. Thanks, sir. Have a good one. Take care, everybody. Right, take care now. Okay. Take care.